Okay, I think we're good. I think we're gonna be good. I, I'm gonna go for it. All right, hey guys, yo, what's up? It's been a while since I've been here. <sighs> yeah, it's been a while. Whatever, I'm here now, that's what matters. Uh, yeah, so what is this video? As you guys can see, it is what is in my camera bag. Now, the reason I haven't done one of these is because I actually didn't have a camera bag. This is what I was using as a camera bag, if you guys can see. This is, uh, what is this? A core, a core bag. I think I got this for like opening up a bank account. There's no pockets, there's no dividers. Oh, can you guys see in there? So I just had my, my gear clanging around in there. Um, yeah. So I finally got myself a real camera bag. So here is what I got. Ugh! This is the Low Pro 450W. 450W? Yeah. Low Pro Pro Tactic. Got this on eBay. Got this used. It was in great condition. Condition, actually. Yeah. Why did I go with this bag? Mainly because Peter McKinnon said it. Said that he liked it, and I got it. I guess that was that was one of the reasons. In that this bag can hold a pro a pro body camera. If I ever upgrade, upgrade to a 1DX, I can put that bag in, put that body in here. It can hold it, a Canelo 70 to 200 and a 15 inch laptop. So I figured this bag can grow with me for a while. And it came with a bunch of accessories that I'm not sure if I'll really keep or use. Okay, anyway, so I don't know how people normally do this. They might have like a top down shot, maybe. This is my first one. I'm sure my second one will be way better. I'm currently going on a shoot tomorrow for like a commercial interview-ish thing. So I, I packed it up. So I was like, hey, I'm a, I could do the video now. Okay, so I know I definitely lack organization, but you guys don't see this. Maybe I could take a picture of this. I'm rambling now. All right, first of all, normally this camera is in there. This is my go-to number one camera. This is my 5D Mark IV that I'm currently shooting on on a 24 to 70 f2.8. So that normally goes in here, but that's not in here because I needed I needed to record. I will need two cameras tomorrow. So I, use, I will bring my Vixia, each FG20. This is okay. I do have some trouble color matching this with this, but it is better than my 6D. My 60D. Yeah, that's just a pain. That's just a pain to try to color correct between the two. Between that, between the 5D and the 60D, this one is much easier to color match. And I'm transferring some files, so this thing is saying that I have duplicates, so let's take care of this. That's my second camera. I also have the uh, extra big, bigger battery back here just for some longer battery life. Pick that up for about 50 bucks, 40 bucks, I forget. Um, so yeah, all right. So next thing is the newer C CN160. This is just a nice little $30 light. This thing comes in very handy, comes in very handy. It just mounts to the top of the camera right here. And it can also mount to a tripod. Yeah, for those dark places, it has a little gel on it. It also has a diffuser but I don't usually use the diffuser. I usually use either this or just this by itself. So I'm putting this stuff up here. I don't know if I want to do that. I don't know if I want to do that because there's a lot more stuff in here. Okay, I have a audio recorder, which is the Tascam. This is bad. Uh, this is a Tascam. I know that. If, I know, fine, if I'm gonna search what, what model this is, put it on the screen right now. Yes, it's a Tascam. You're probably wondering, why, don't, why doesn't he know what, what type of rec audio recorder this is? Because this was a gift from a friend. He upgraded to something better, greater, and stronger. And he was like, hey, you, uh, you can have this. So I was like, sure, because mine, which I'm currently using, I normally use a Zoom H4n. It's been great, it's been fantastic. You can see it right here. This is what I normally use. I got this used as well. But you can also see that there is some damage. Can you guys see that? There's some damage to the mics. Um, I've dropped it. My mom has dropped it, but I've dropped it. It's been dropped. How about that? It's been dropped several times and these mics, uh, yeah, have been damaged. Something is wrong with the jack, with the first, with jack number one. You might hear some popping as I do that. So yeah. I just realized that that might be all crackly and stuff. I have this guy in here. I don't always use this. This is the Black Magic, Black, no, Black Rapid. I'm sure there's some kind of a part number for it, but this is just the shoulder, uh, shoulder strap for the camera. I hate neck straps. Not hate, 
there is one that I like, and that is just a custom made one that I got from a very special friend. There we go, this one. And uh, this is the only neck strap that I like. It's got my initials on, so it's pretty cool. All right, next is my uh, Pelican SD card case. Oh, you guys can't see that. Really like this thing because before I got this, my SD cards are just all over the place. This is not even all of them, but this was all, it was all over the place. So I think it's weather, it's weather resistant. Might be waterproof, water resistant. I think it's water resistant, not waterproof. There is a, there is a gasket that goes around here. Okay, this is one of the little bags that I got extra with this bag. This is my battery bag, my battery charger bag. So I have my charger for my five, my 5D and 60D, uh, two extra batteries for the 5D and 60D and an extra battery for the newer light. All of those neatly stay in here, go in here, live in here every time I go on a shoot. Usually I do like weddings and I'm trying to get out of that, but you know, weddings peg. Um, okay, th and now I have my flash. My flash just lives in here. This is my uh, Godox. If I'm saying that right, uh, TT58, nope, TT685C. Uh, this is just a simple flash that I got. I normally do video stuff, but sometimes I'll do photos. And when I do photos, I need to have a flash. Uh, one of my friends is a photographer. Asked him what, what, what flash I should get. He suggested this one. I'm not sure if I'm liking all this black abyss that's happening right here. But you know, whatever. We're gonna keep it. We're gonna keep it going. So in the little sections, I have my compact flash. This also just lives in my bag. This is like uh, if I ever need to shoot in 4K because these cards are starting to. These cards right here. The cards in here are starting to get old, and I need to replace them at some point. But they can't really handle the 4K speed that this does. So if I ever need to shoot in 4K, I have a little 32 gig uh, flash compact flash that I have. A Sharpie, because you'll be surprised how many times you need to have a Sharpie. Uh, next little compartment, this, this probably should go in my battery box, but this these are some extra rechargeables for the audio recorder and for the flash when I use it. But I got this little these little containers off of Amazon and uh, it just keeps them nice and neat and a little package and yeah. So some AA batteries for that. Uh, do, 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 do. Oh, I have my wallet or a wallet. This is one of the this is one of the many wallets that I have. There's a little bit of money in here for parking, tolls. Yeah, I'd say that's about it. Earphones. Now you're probably wondering why do I have earphones? These earphones seal my ears very, very well. They're almost like earplugs. So, like I said, I no I normally do a lot of weddings. Weddings have DJs, and for some reason, in DJ school, they teach them to like crank the volume up to 3,000 in a room that's like the size of a normal dining room or something. So normally it's way too loud. I actually don't like loud noises, even though I like playing the drums, which has always been weird. So I uh, so these uh, seal my ears very well. I probably should put in a pair of earplugs before I lose these, because these are currently good earphones, but uh, but it's also nice because it's on a string and if someone needs to talk to me, I can pop them out, listen to what they have to say and put them back in. So, all right, we also have, I need to sub this out, but this is a cable that I had downstairs for my guitar and I've just been keeping it around. It's a little too long, but this is just a quarter inch, a quarter inch uh, cable that I have right here. This is for usually plugging into the DJ's output and putting it into one of these two audio recorders for a uh, for the toast all right uh here is a two millimeter wrench i believe that's what it is it's a two millimeter wrench this wrench is for my cheap alex glide cam which is right down here this thing i need to i need to i need to get rid of this thing. i should burn it and tell everyone never to get this thing ever this is a uh, maybe i shouldn't be saying this it's rough it's very rough it loses balance it uh it's hard to balance it's good for if you're just starting out i guess but I just save up your money and get a real glide cam. So either way, so these, so this is good for this handle screw. There's a set screw right here for this. And that's really the only thing I need to adjust is this. And I used to, oh, I still do have it, okay. This is a, just a little flathead screwdriver. This actually is my dad's and I need to return it to him. 
but this is just a little flathead screwdriver again for my for my glide cam this is to screw in the camera can you guys see that okay there's a little there's a flat screw right here and this is just to screw in the camera to the to this plate right here you could use a quarter but this is a small compact screwdriver that i keep in my bag for that purpose okay this is a quarter inch to uh, one eighth inch adapter in case the only output that the dj has is like a headphone um, or earphone jack or something i haven't needed needed to use this but i just thought i'd throw it in there in case i do all right so that's it that's that's what's in my camera bag uh yeah 2019 maybe i'll do these once a year so i hope you guys enjoyed this video i kind of enjoyed made it making it yeah tune in next week tune in next time i wish i could tell you guys when the next video is going to come out i really don't know and i want to i want to do better with that but yeah so thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed it thank you for you know hitting the like button commenting all that all that stuff and let me know what kind of bag you guys use if you have a camera bag even if it's a little bag that you got from opening a bank account just let me know what you guys use all right yeah i guess that's it toodles